Gwendolyn, you've returned. I have an announcement, Your Majesty, regarding the invasion. Our troops have been lost. The foes had more reinforcements than we had anticipated. We were forced to enter a battle of attrition. The Valkyries suffered many casualties, including Griselda, our commander. I know of Griselda's fate. Griselda fought bravely for you to the very end. She entrusted me with a spear in her final moments. She was the most gallant and noble of all my warriors. That spear is a special weapon known as a cipher. It collects spirits that haunt battlefields and uses their power to smite enemies. Henceforth, you shall wield the spear as you please. We shall launch another assault on the enemy. I shall personally take part in this battle. Send the troops when you're prepared. Father! Is that all you have to say about Griselda? Words will not bring your sister back. There's no time for sentimentality. Princess, we shall regroup with those able to fight. At the moment, I have four soldiers ready. Just say the word. We only have half the troops we started with. Everyone is rushing to their death. Princess, that was close. I had heard that the Shadow Knight looked like a demon, but... He seemed human to me. Why did he let you go? What? Griselda's dead because she rushed ahead of the main forces. It's certainly not because I was late to the battle. Lord Brigan, you may be one of our nation's heroes, but I hear that you act as you wish because my father does nothing to stop you. Dastardly queen of the fairies? She was the one who summoned the dragon. That dastardly queen of the fairies? Oh, princess, hear me out. That spear is a magical weapon called a cipher. The dwarves fashion the crystals out of jewels and use them in the weapons. It absorbs magical elements called phosons and is able to absorb and release them. It will surely lead you to victory. My dear princess, that stone on your spear is a jewel from the netherworld. Did you know that? Traveling from this world to the netherworld is very dangerous, and only one man is able to do it, King Odin. If we can obtain that cauldron and fabricate our own jewels, Ragnanov will have no more enemies. Princess Gwendolyn, I am worried about you. Please stay strong. Thank you, Miras. I shall bring some tea up to your room later. I'm a traveling vendor who has been allowed to sell in this castle. Is there uh, anything you need?
Inform the troops. Griselda. So you're going to battle in order to win your father's love. That's not true. I'm fighting for my kingdom and my own pride. If I fall in battle, that is a fate all my countrymen must face. Don't try to hide the truth from me. You seek death so that you may earn the love you so desperately seek. Quiet! I am but a phantom. I represent your innermost thoughts. I am pathetic. I've never been loved since the day I was born. Giving your life for your father will not make your death worthwhile. You will simply die. Like Griselda died. Stop it! If I sacrifice myself for my duty, Father will surely show his love for me. Surely. Yeah. <laughs> 